Let's go over how to force push. The first thing you need to be aware of is that you're messing with the powers that be. There is potential here to overwrite commits. However, there are cases where this is exactly what you want to do. I have a commit here where I've created a file named demo.md. I no longer want this commit at all. I can overwrite it by performing a force push. You may not want to use this technique if another developer has already pushed changes to your upstream. It is possible to force push and overwrite their commits. Let's start by creating a new commit to overwrite with. First, I will hard reset to the place I want the new commit to link to. I'll right click, reset, hard. The head of my local branch master now points to this git commit hash. I'll quickly create a new file by coming up here to the main menu clicking File, New File, I'll paste in some content, I'll save this, give it a name, I'll close my editor, and we can see that these uncommitted changes are pointing to the right git commit hash. Now I'll stage and finalize our new commit. I'll stage the file, Go ahead and customize our commit message here. I'll click commit. And now we see that the new commit is pointing to the right commit hash. Let's do one more thing here. Let's write down the name of the commit that we're going to overwrite. I'll open up sticky notes. Here's the commit that we want to overwrite. I'll come up here and copy the git commit hash and paste it in my sticky notes. 42d826a, 42d826a. Now let's perform the force push. I'll come up here to the main menu. I'll click remote, push to. And here I want to push to a remote branch called origin master. We're going to tick the box that says force. Now it's time to release the Kraken. Looks like the force pushes over. Let's check the log again. Get ahead was successfully able to push master to origin. Our add tutorial commit is right on top of update test. And we can further confirm this by going back to the git hash we wrote down. 42d826a no longer exist. That concludes this tutorial on force push. You may also find these videos helpful.